Welcome to this ESN Smart Nitrogen virtual farming experience. Drag your mouse or tilt your handheld device for a 360 degree view of this field. Let's begin our plot tour of ESN on corn in northeastern Arkansas with Mike Howell. Well, good morning. Thank you for coming to our field tour here in northeast Arkansas this morning. Uh, today we're going to be talking about ESN, environmentally smart nitrogen, and the benefits it has to corn production here in the Delta uh, area of the country. Uh, nitrogen loss is, is really important to, to growers here in the Delta region. Uh, we can lose nitrogen from volatilization, we can lose nitrogen to leaching, or denitrification. Uh, wet conditions like we have here today, we're more worried about things like denitrification and leaching with this excess water. Let's take a closer look at how ESN works to make your operation better. ESN technology uses a flexible polymer coating to encapsulate a nitrogen granule. The coating protects the end from loss mechanisms, releasing it when the crop needs it most. The membrane allows water to diffuse in, dissolve the end granule, and create a water and urea solution. The granule then releases nitrogen at a predictable rate, controlled by soil temperature. Now let's head back to the field to see how well ESN performs. So in this location, we're look, actually evaluating ESN in two different trials. Uh, the field on my right is a, an ESN trial looking at different rates and timings, uh, different rates and blends. Uh, we're, we're looking at blends of 50%, 75%, and 100% ESN and comparing that to straight urea. Uh, we're looking at rates ranging all the way from zero pounds of nitrogen, which you can see in the, the check plot here in front of me, all the way up to 300 total pounds of nitrogen. Uh, typically what we see in these situations is about a 10 bushel yield increase from the ESN because it's protecting that nitrogen, allowing the nitrogen to be there later into the growing season when that crop actually needs it. I uh, pulled two ears of corn here today. This is from a 300 pound uh, plot with 75% uh, of that nitrogen coming from ESN. Uh, this is 300 pounds of nitrogen coming from urea. You can see there's a, a big difference in the size of these ears here. It's been extremely wet in this part of Arkansas this year. We've had a lot of nitrogen loss, uh, pro primarily from denitrification in these plots. And that's why we're seeing these uh, differences in the size of these ears today. Uh, the plot here on my left, we're evaluating different uh, timings of application. Uh, most growers are applying uh, nitrogen three times in corn in this part of the country. They're putting out a, an application at planting. They're putting out a side dress application about V4, V5, uh, maybe a little later. And then they're putting out a, a pre-tassel application to carry that uh, corn all the way through the, the growing season. Uh, we're comparing those, that standard application to ESN applied one time or two times. And, and what we found in other studies is that ESN is able to protect that nitrogen and we can eliminate that uh, third application in this corn crop. Thanks for joining us. We hope you enjoyed this ESN Smart Nitrogen virtual farming experience. Visit smartnitrogen.com for more information.